On behalf of Expert Trade, I take great pleasure in welcoming you to the 11th annual Middle East Banking Innovation Summit Plus 2021. Brilliant, I would say. It's really been a great, a great experience and pleasure to be here. And I'm pretty sure many of us who have worked very effectively during the lockdowns and the pandemic are eager to go back in person events. So very happy to be with you today and all the best. Absolutely, it's brilliant. I mean, it's been a year and a half of talking into a, a monitor, right? It's been brilliant. Uh, I think the event is very well organized, social distancing and all these kinds of things. It's just refreshing talking to people again. We went from Morocco all the way through to Pakistan and of course involving the UAE where payment transformation is at the heart of everything they're doing. And what came out with my other panellists is that GDP growth is firmly linked to digital payments. Direct correlation. The central bank digital currencies, what's the future? It will happen. The central banks will play a key role and we think that the private and public partnership needs to come together as an ecosystem to drive those digital currencies at the next phase of digital payments. So very exciting and the future is all about payments, bro. Personally, I'm looking forward to attending the event again and coming and sharing the industry view uh, with the audience in the room or the ones who are listening here. So I would like to again thank the event organizers and the participants here. It has been a very vibrant environment, I would say, and uh, looking forward to come again. It was a pleasure after a long time to catch up in person with people. Uh, it's been too long virtual presence, uh, so it was good. We obviously talked about the role of the CXOs in digital transformation, uh, about the priorities, about the, the role of the cloud uh, and other technologies in digital transformation. It's not just about investing in technology for its own sake. It's all about creating something that leads towards a good customer experience, something that leads towards reaching business objective and really going by business priorities and things you want to accomplish and understanding the ROI or the NPV of, of what you are doing. So quite exciting. It was a, a good panel, a good uh, participants up there. It was very interesting to have that conversation. To be here was actually really fantastic for us so far. Um, we attending lots of uh, investment summits, family office summits, but being here on a more innovative kind of summit with more an eye on technology and the innovation in the banking field has been an amazing experience so far. So thank you very much. Kudos to you guys and kudos to the organizers. Uh, very well organized and uh, all precautions taken, so there's no harm, you know, meeting people in person. And looking forward to more of these. It was fantastic. This is uh, one of the things that I opened the, the, the keynote with. It's so enjoyable to have a, another face-to-face -face event. There really is nothing like the, the engagement that you get one-to-one -one with individuals. So uh, very, very pleased to be back in person uh, meeting people face-to-face. It was fabulous. I think this is something that I would like to see much more of. Uh, hopefully the pandemic is more or less behind us. It was a very interesting panel. I think it was very engaging and the panelists were very engaging too. It's been um, something that we've been missing for the last 18 months. Ability to have meetings in person, meeting people, it means so much more than being just having a virtual event. We just had an opportunity to talk about harnessing big data and how this is going to uh, help financial institutions uh, drive the growth of their businesses by looking at different type of structured and structured information, how can it be leveraged, what technology can be used, how can it be processed. Every opportunity we have some challenges, especially around skills and how people can adopt and change the culture in order to adopt these new technologies. The panel was pretty much excited about to talk about their real-time experiences and talk about where they see the growth, especially here in the UAE, where how the, this is going to benefit the customer experience after all. What really impressed me was the number of uh, exhibitors over here. I think they should make some kind of a transparent masks because you still sort of, you know, you don't know whether they're smiling or frowning behind it, but loved it. Uh, first one after the summer and great conference. Thank you for inviting me.